Hello and welcome to this HowTech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to create labels in Excel and print them out in Microsoft Word. So to get started, we're just going to type in first name in the first column here. And say I wanted to print out some labels to stick onto some personal belongings so that people know that they're mine. And I'll have a phone number column. So, the name's Doe, John Doe, and for example, he lives on 123 Doe Street, and we'll keep the phone number pretty simple. So instead of just dragging all this down the exact same thing, I have some friends who also want some labels. So I'll type their names down here. Timmy Dean, Robert, Jim, and finally Beatrice, Al. Assuming we all live on the same street, I can hold down control and click and drag this handle down, and it'll stay the exact same thing. And I'll do the same for the phone number, because we happen to have the same phone number. Press Control S, go to the desktop, and we'll save it as labels. So we can head out of there, and then we can go ahead and open up Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word, and blank document. So we're starting from scratch, head over to Mailings, and then we need to start the Mail Merge and Labels, because that's what we're doing. So, my label vendor is an Avery A4 A5. Then I just need to find the product number. Now it's going to be different for whatever office supplier you get these from and whatever you choose, but it should say the product number and the label vendor on the packet you buy with all of the labels. So here's my product number. Now that I've selected my product number, as well as my label vendor, I can just go ahead and click OK. So if I hit Control A, select everything, you see I have all of these sections. And what we need to do now is we need to select the recipients. And we already have an existing list. Found on the desktop, Labels, we're doing Sheet 1. First row of data contains column headers and hit OK. Then we need to insert a merge field. And first name, we'll center that, bold it. Oops, we'll just bold that to make a statement. And then we'll hit enter. And next we want the address showing. So, don't want that bolded. Hit enter again, and we can insert the phone numbers. So this will be the same for all of their sections. We just need update labels, and there you have it. Don't worry about the next record such. We can preview our results up here, and we'll see that we have John Doe, address, and we have Jane Doe, and so on. So everything's working quite nicely. When we're done with all of that, we can go ahead and hit Finish and Merge, and then we can print our documents, we can edit the individual ones, and we can even send the email message. So this has been a HowTech video tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.